So hello to all of you, wherever you may be, from the Juventus Stadium in the Alpine city of Turin. I'm Peter Drury, and seated in the experts' hot seat is our man Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. It's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. Two starting lineups. we go then. And it's Danny Alves. direct keeps everyone guessing first quarter of an hour gone midway through the first half and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern and, and probably most of the stadium too let's just hope that by the end it'll have been forgotten that's a pop goal Juventus he was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Yeah, his instinct told him that the keeper would struggle to cope with that, so top marks for him following up. I think um, it's really sharp play, it was well read, and he was a little quicker than everybody else. Juventus break the deadlock. Oh, they've done well to take the lead there, but they can't let their opponents back in. They have to stay focused. Good idea, just poorly executed. So they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Spoon forward. He's gone for it! That is wayward. Yeah, the first touch was the thing to pick out there. That was really nice, but what followed was a big disappointment, and he'll know now what he needs to work on. Good run through the middle, but he needs support. Tries a long pass towards the front. Danny Alves. Who's loose? Who's getting there? Oh, didn't catch it right. The quicker an attacker gets the ball under control, the more time he creates for himself. That was very neat and tidy to set up the shot. Up to me! 
beat it! Danger averted for now. And the ball's come out! It's Danny Alves. Daniel Alves looking for options. Oh, he's put too much on it. It's the route one option. We've reached half time. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Juventus leading 1 0 at the break. Gets things going for the second half. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Timely intervention. Papa! Decent attempt, but. Quite good enough. Well, the defender was stuck to him like glue, but he got his effort away. It wasn't quite enough, though. Pumps it upfield. Benucci. Juventus just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. Marquisio plays it out to the wing. Can he deliver? Evra drills one in. Long and forward. No, it's not getting there. Tries to get it forward quickly. Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Chiellini. Juventus haven't made a substitution yet. And Jukic gets on the end of it. It's in! And surely now the results beyond doubt. And Jukic. This is the keeper, and only one winner. I just thought he was alert and direct. There was no messing about. He was too quick for the keeper, and that's a fine finish. Juventus take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Pogba. They really are proving themselves to be solid all over the field. Juventus have time on their side now, as well as a two-goal lead. It is just about done. Now the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Looks to dink one in. Tries a header! Oh, surely that deserved better. And that all stems from great vision, you know, what a... So that's it, it is all over.
So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance and a result which is well deserved. Your reflections then, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That eases the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. Well, that's it for tonight's match, so it just remains for me.